right, Carlene, rolling into the weekend strong with this weather. It is something to look forward to. That's right. Bring it on, Mother Nature. Big time. <laughs> oh, we got the sunshine going, Carlo. It is going to be nice tomorrow. So temperatures are going to be a little bit warmer as we continue to have this ridge of high pressure that's over us. Highs for today. So we uh, dropped about 5 to 10 degrees off of our highs yesterday tack them right back on today. So we had the 60s right along the coast. You're also talking about more 70s that were popping up inland. We were at widespread 60s yesterday, low 60s to be exact. And uh, for today, we had 76 degrees. And that was a high for Escondido. Also 77 degrees for Valley Center. 73 to, uh, degrees today for El Cajon and also 90 degrees getting right back into those 90s across the desert. Lots of sunshine, clear skies right now and also talking about 64 degrees for downtown. We have a breeze out of the west northwest at about 10 miles miles per hour. Take a look at those temperatures. So we're getting down into the 50s and that's going to be the case for downtown starting at 8 p.m. and take that all the way into the overnight hours. Most of your overnight lows will be into the 50s and that's going to be along the coast as well as inland. So area of low pressure that one right over uh, portions of I uh, basically seeing that move in towards the Great Plains. That's going to continue to move towards the east as it does. High pressure was building in right behind it, and that's going to be the case through tomorrow. Temperatures even warmer. Then we have this other area of low pressure that's going to move in. Track is going to stay so far to the north. It's not going to do anything except for deepen that marine layer and then talk about gusty winds. So we're going to have those gusts picking up across inland regions, the strongest for the mountains and the desert, back into the 40s and 50s when it comes to those wind gusts. Then we have yet another area of low pressure that's going to move in. So this troughing pattern is going to take us all the way into the start of next week, and that's going to have our temperatures slipping each day. And then as we get into the middle of the week, we are looking at a warm up. Unfortunately, the track staying so far to the north, we're not looking at any shower activity and we definitely need it across the county. And you're seeing a major deficit across much of the county, anywhere between about three to roughly about four and a half inches. Taking a look at your eight day microclimate forecast, you got the 60s going strong all the way into next week. Also talking about the upper 70s to low 80s inland for tomorrow. Then we get back into those low 70s as we go through Tuesday. Talking about 70s tomorrow for the mountains. Pretty nice out there. Back into the 60s on Sunday. Gusty winds and 89 uh, for the desert, John, on Sunday.